Following a detailed materiality review of Cundall in 2017, we've identified six impacts as being of most significance to our business and have established priority objectives for these. Ethics and equity. We actively support and encourage a diverse workforce as we believe it will make our business stronger. Attracting and retaining the best in industry will help us to make better decisions and ultimately enhance the service we provide to our clients. In addition, we will be implementing a bid, no bid process to ensure that all our projects align with our values, as well as targeting aid agency projects and providing our services pro bono. So if you have a project that you think we, we should support, which needs the skills that we offer, please apply for funding. So ethics and equality I think is kind of central to our approach to sustainability in the business and it's important that we ensure all our staff are valued and respected uh, equally. I think it's also important that we value diversity in our business um, because it brings a balance of skills and experiences to us and I think that's beneficial to us as a business and to our clients in the projects we deliver. Ethics and equity is very important to me because I believe everyone on earth should have an equal opportunity to achieve whatever they want in their lifetime. I'm part of the Ethics and Equity Working Group. Um, this is really important to me because I think as a business, uh, Kundal will be better and better by being more diverse um, and having people with different backgrounds and different inputs into the business. Um, there's a lot of stuff that we're doing around this at the moment. Uh, it's a big initiative for Kundal. Um, and uh, I think it's just a case of watch this space really. As a business uh, and, and as an industry actually in this region, there's a lot to be done in the area of ethics and equity and how uh, people are treated in terms of the fairness of how they're treated in terms of labour, uh, in terms of uh, the uh, rewards that people get from their work. There has been a tendency in this market to take advantage of people from different uh, ethnic backgrounds and from, from different means. And I think as a business, we've always treated every member of our staff equally. In the future, I hope I can empower the younger generation, the children, on my skill set so they can make an impact and make a positive contribution to the community and to the world. I ran a workshop with some students from Gateshead College uh, and that raised their awareness of embodied energy, waste minimisation, sustainable drainage. I'm sure they found it beneficial and thought-provoking and they can carry it forward into their working lives. So I've done a few projects throughout my career that definitely made a positive impact to the community. I've joined NGOs and went to Cambodia, raised some funds to help them build a community centre. I joined Food Angel in Hong Kong, prepared the food for the lunch boxes for the elderly people. I've also cleaned the streets in Sydney. Yes, we're doing some pro bono work for a charitable organisation, Ruben's Retreat, and they provide uh, care support for uh, terminally ill children, essentially, and their families. So a really worthwhile cause. They're regenerating a hospital building near, nearby, and it's been great. We've been able to offer our engineering input to create a sustainable building well-being at the heart as well to create hopefully nurturing environments to support those families through hard times.